Welcome to Daily Express, where we have a different notion of oversize. I'm Eric Thompson, Director of Recruiting. One of the most popular questions we get asked in the recruiting department is what are our tie-down equipment? Well, today I'd like to take a few minutes and go over what we require and why we require it. I'm here with Nicole Coy, Senior Recruiter here at Daily Express, and we're going to take a look at the tie-down equipment. The first thing we require here at Daily Express is a cab rack or headache rack. This item right here is a sturdy light rack. We keep these in stock here in Carlisle. They do come with the tie-down equipment. They come with the uh, locking chain and binder hangers on the top and a full-length tray across the bottom. And for contractors coming in here to Carlisle, we do give them a helping hand to get these things installed. Next item I'd like to show here is the chain that we use at Daily Express, and this is a very important item that we use. Uh, Daily Express, we require the 3 8 inch grade 70 chain. Um, this is a brand new chain. They are American made. We keep these in stock here at Carlisle all the time. Next chain right here I'd like to show, this is a half inch chain. This is what I like to call the monster chain or the man chain. Uh, these half inch chains, these are actually grade 80. These are alloy grade chains. And my four axle special equipment drivers are using these chains right here. Uh, they'll have at least five of these half inch chains on their truck in addition to the 3 8 chains. I'd like to show this here for comparison. This is a 5 16 inch chain. Uh, a lot of guys do come in with the 5 16 inch chains. Nothing wrong with this chain for most machinery hauling, but at Daily Express we have a philosophy of over secure rather than under secure. So we go up to the 3 8 inch grade 70 chain, so you don't want to bring in these 5 16 Next item right here I'd like to show is the binder. And the binder, of course, has to meet or exceed the strength of your chain. And what we require at Daily Express, this is a 3 8 inch binder. It is a ratchet binder. It's a 3 8 inch binder, but it's got a half inch grab hook on the end. The reason we want the half inch grab hook, a lot of times you might be going into a half inch chain. You might be going into these heavy D rings on these heavy haul trailers that we run at Daily Express. So you want to use a 3 8 inch binder, again, with a half inch hook. And this guy right here has a working load limit of 9,200 pounds. If you're ever curious about the working load limit on your binder, you'll want to look at the handle of the binder. It's going to be embossed right on the handle. Right here we've got the monster binders. These are for the half inch chains and these guys have a heavy working load limit of 11,200 11, pounds. What we don't want to see at Daily Express are these guys. This is a snap binder. It's a 5 16 inch snap binder with a 5 16 inch hook. It's got a working load limit of about 5,400 pounds. Again, these work fine for 5 16 inch chains, but they're not going to work with the 3 8 inch chain that we have here at Daily. Another item we want to avoid here at Daily. This is a 3 8 inch binder. While this binder works okay with 3 8 inch chain, it's got a 3 8 inch hook, it's not going to be the same working load limit as the other binders that I just showed earlier. Next item I want to go over are these straps. We get a lot of questions on the straps that we use here at Daily Express. And this is a 4 inch nylon strap. It's got a chain end on the end, it's got an anchor hook or a chain grab on the end, and this is what we'd rather see rather than the flat hooks. We pretty much require these chain ends on our straps here at Daily because we're using our straps, a lot, of, a lot of times we're using our straps just like a chain. We're going at angles with our chain, and as you can see, these heavy haul trailers, they don't have rub rails to go into with a flat hook. So we want to have a four inch strap, this four inch nylon strap, we've got the chain end, and the other component to that strap is a hand ratchet. We get asked a lot of times about the ratchets that we require, and you do need to have hand-powered ratchets for your straps. Now we sell this at Daily Express. We sell these as an assembly with the strap and the hand ratchet, but take note that none of our trailers are equipped with winches. None of our trailers have spools on the side. That's why you've got to have these guys right here.